Hi everyone, my name is Vivek and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is the 13th and final episode to add custom jQuery components on a fitness website. In the previous episode, we work on load more posts. And today, we'll work on this responsive burger menu. First of all, let's check the HTML structure using developer tool. We got nav with an id nav and inside it we have got a button and a URL tag. This button is a responsive burger menu which is currently hidden using display none for the desktop version. But for tablet and mobile version Using the media query, we have used display block to show them. Also, in the same media query, we have added some additional CSS for this UL tag, which is our menu, so that it gets hidden. So, we have applied fixed position over here, along with fixed width and a left value with negative 250px. Now, our only goal is to add a toggle class called navbar active in this UL tag whenever we click on this burger menu. So, let's click them. The menu then gets visible because in this class name called navbar active, you can see the left position has set to 0. Now, let's add them in main.js. We have to add click event for this button, so I will copy this class name and then I will open the main.js and then here I will add the click event for that button. I will also add the comment called responsive menu and then whenever we click on this button we have to add a toggle class called navbar active so I will do toggle class and the name of class is navbar active now go back to your site again and you can see this ul tag is next to this button so over here we can say dollar this dot next dot toggle class and it seems our class name is mystic it should be navbar active once done you can go to the site you can open your tablet or mobile version and if you click on this burger menu you should see a menu over here great this is the end of this final session feel free to comment below if you have any questions also please don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel to get more tutorials in the future finally thank you so much for choosing my youtube channel to learn jquery components i will see you again next time with the next course if you want some hosting companies, then you can check the link in the description below. Thank you and all the best.